out Aegis Styles. And right now, we're just going to try and do the main story, but not do. Hey! It's X Pac! Just keep walking, we don't have time. We always have time for X Pac. Besides, you can't just ignore a WWE Hall of Famer. I can. Trey. Pac! What's going on? Hey guys, looking good. You too. Thanks. I'm on this new mustard only diet. As in, mustard is the only condiment you use? No, as in, I only eat mustard. I've already dropped like seven pounds. That's interesting. But enough about me. This is your big night. I swear it was just like yesterday when I first saw you two on the indie scene. Yeah, at that point we were only a couple years in. And I was about 30 years in. But I could still go today if I had to. I'm telling you, this diet's legit. I guess you could say you can cut the mustard, huh? Anyway, we wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for you. So, thanks. I'm sure you'd have been fine with it without my help. Trey, I don't think I can say the same for you. You were kind of the drizzling craps back then, no offense. No, it's true. And I wasn't just a drizzle. I was more like a torrential downpour of crap. Red was always ahead of me from the moment we started training. Uh, I don't know about that. Because, <laughs> you know, see, even though they're trying to focus on the my, the women's my career, you know, at least it's still main focus. All right. All right. You can use this credit card for whatever you need, but we keep the reward points. I'm about 10,000 short of a free trip to someplace warm, and you're gonna help me get there. Deal? Got it. We are gonna miss oh. you so much. When did you get there? I just had to be close to you one more time. It, it feels like yesterday we got that call, there was a boy in Denver who was ready to be adopted, and now you're all grown up and going off to college. I, I, I just can't believe it. <laughs> I know. Hard for me to believe, too. We'll come visit soon, okay? No, don't. I mean, a, a big part of college is learning independence, and if you're visiting all the time, then I'll never be able to do that. Just be smart about the credit card, okay? Like, if there's a big keg party, put it all on the card and have everyone pay you back in cash. That way, I'll be headed for that free beach trip in no time. Hey, maybe we could go on spring break together. Frank? I have to go. Okay, drive safe. This is the part where you get out of the car. <laughs> right. Call us when you get to school. We love you, Denver! I'm guessing they don't know what's actually happening. In the play tab, if you're the money in the bank winner, you can cash in ahead of time before the match, but only if you really want a fair and square tournament. Do you believe this? We're finally doing it. Our very first list item, train at the dungeon. Are you excited as I am? I don't oh think that's God. possible considering you've already had three energy drinks before we've even left town, <laughs> but this is gonna be cool. I know. Think about how many top superstars came through Calgary. The Hearts, Edge, Jake the Snake Roberts, Rowdy Roddy Piper, and we're next. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have a long way to go before we can be mentioned in the same sentence as those legends. Everyone has to start somewhere though, right? And the dungeon is a great place to start. I still can't believe your parents were okay with all this. What happened to them wanting you to go to college? They changed their minds. Just like that? Just like that. Huh. Well, that's good. Hey, pull over real quick. Bathroom break already? No, I want to show you something. See that sign? Our faces are going to be on it someday. You really think we can become more famous than the inventor of the paper toilet seat cover? He put a lot of butts in seats. And when we make it to WWE, so will we.
All right. She's very trying to <clears throat> make it to the baby. She's like, um, she's the type of person that's like going to make it happen. Like it's not possible. And then Trey just like, ah, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. New and W320 go to either my player's phone by pressing Y and pressing Y again. Look at my entries list. Check the list throughout the career to see what gets that. Get, yeah, see what gets added and crossed off. Red. Giant again. Um. Can I get? No. I didn't mean to do that. I want to see if I can get points for doing nothing. Okay, so you have to team up with Big GM? And what's a cry bite? What's a cry baby match? I don't know what I said. Uh, what's a cry baby match? for order please check your email for tracking information thank you well it's the same though it's the same from both people um i changed her name i literally just changed her name For a road trip game, if you could face anyone who trained in Calgary in a dream match, who would it be? Isn't it a little early for road trip games? We still have like 2,000 miles to go. Come on, I'll get you started with some options. How about Bret Hart, Jake the Snake, no. or easy, easy. Rowdy Roddy Piper? Uh, I don't think so. Um. I guess Bret Hart, because... That would be so cool to face a legend like that. Could you imagine? Are you... I don't want to fight Bret Hart right now. They're really going to make me fight Bret Hart right now. Is 
Alright, you got me. You got Bret Hart. Let's get it. So you know when you're on a long drive to the next town and to pass the time, you start coming up with dream match scenarios? Well, these two facing each other is exactly that. These are certainly two of the top names to ever pass through the Great White North. When I'm on a long drive, I'm mostly just thinking about how grateful I am to be Byron Free at the time. Ah, uh, you know you miss me. Not Bam. a chance. Wow. Finds a way to reverse. Mm. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. Stomping down! Oh! Uh, Boom! Spikes him down. So now it's Bret Hart on the I defensive. A, um, Taking on some offense, but he expected as much. Of my career. And I gave this character insulting, showing a lot of fury with these attacks. He's definitely got all pistons oh. firing right now. He's taking it up top. Whoa! I'm how I got this. Massive double foot stomp. Um, you know, watching Bret Hart in action here is just a reminder that he may be the greatest here. technical wrestler and of all time. How do you counter that kind of dominance? If you want to beat the Hitman, you need to use hit and run mm. tactics to maintain some space and stay on your I feet. Our team. He's able to lock you up. It's all over. Brett wants to take this battle to the mm. mat as much as possible where mm. he can maintain complete control. No. As his opponent, no. you can't let him trap you. Bulldog! Ah, oh, shit. I might be. Ah, oh, snap there. Do I have to win this? What's this? Did the hitman come to wrestle? Didn't say or that just showboat? Saw what he had in mind there. Missile drop kick finds its mark. Mm -hmm. Boom! <laughs> How is he getting so many damn reversals? Incredible oh, athleticism. Oh, that was just malicious. With all due respect, I think we're seeing the end for Red Hart. He's totally out of it. Nobody's home upstairs. Yeah, We've right. seen Bret Hart make some big comebacks before, and he'll the need combo. to do it again. Yeah, that and a miracle. Jesus. Great display of strength with the suplex. Damn. He's playing with him Damn. now. No, wait. And no. Bret Hart slips out of harm's way. No. So quick. And now that was countered. That was but impressive, my boy. Ah, uh, okay. Spiked into the ring apron. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Is it a DCS into the knee? Couldn't get it that time. Come in, Bret Hart, come on. Get your ass up. Uh, please don't be left on Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Oh, that was just Fucking malicious. Fucking Bret Hart. Oh, we got him. I didn't even put this in here. He's already in here to begin with. Oh, nasty Boom. impact. Big insult. Damn. With a nice reversal. Right. Whoa, it's another mm. reversal. Yeah. Back suplex. Yeah. He is efficient and dangerous with his offense thus far. Yeah, he's a guy who can turn up the volume whenever he has to. Bam. Bam. Break fingers. Oh, what impact! Ah. No. Yeah, it's Bret Hart taking full advantage. That's why you're the best analyst in the game. Leg drop. Damn it, I'm trying to. 
Congratulations, Tom. All right. Bam. Bam. What a counter. Bam. Yet another oh, counter. Son of a bitch. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's kidding. guess how this one's going to end. I literally get my signature. This man. Textbook this vertical suplex. Bam. Oh, stomp it away. Oh, that was just malicious. Fuck it, bitch. Saw that one coming. To the torso here. You eliminate the core. This is a great move. Swiss one nine. Inside the ring now. Into the hammerlock. Oh man. Oh boy. Ah. Suplex. And Bret Hart slips out of harm's way so quick. Oh my, how do you have a reversal, dude? Oh, I'm not annoying person right now. Oh, working on the arm. Oh, again! He's fighting hard and it's paying off. Yeah, showing some great technique and full of energy right now. Both wrists captured and that was nasty. Mm. We might be looking at a rare hitman loss here, guys. A clubbing blow called that should end it. There's the pan. Ken is upon a kick out. Guy. One, two. Three. You can't teach the type of tenacity no. we're witnessing here. Unreal. That combo is not bad. That's bullshit. He cheated. Break your fingers. Oh, what impact! Damn. Keep your eyes on this one. Bro, he's gonna take forever to get on the damn knuckle. You're not even hurt, man. You're fine. Oh, look out! Yeah. And Bret Hart slipped out of harm's oh, way God. so quick. Look at this. Damn. Ah, stamina. There's a pin now. And he got a near fall out of it. Can you believe what he's withstood here tonight? Mm. Red Hart with a nice reversal. How impressive was that reversal? Far over to the face. Oh, nothing fancy about that. Bret Hart taking full advantage. That's why you're the best analyst in the game, Corey. Watch out! Ronnie pulls off. Showing some quickness. And this match can change that fast. Not again. Which of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand? Nice no, kick out there. 
This arena has come unglued. You can feel the foundation shifting with every turn in the match. Drop kick! Great athleticism. Yeah. I need my reverse. Farms for the second rope. Drive. Bret Hart makes a cover. And another kick out. No. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Bret Hart looking to end things. No. Sharpshooter. Submission. Submission. No. Bret's got the shot. Bret's got the shot. Sharpshooter. Can't stop, won't stop, get guap. Ten white toes and them toy flip flops. Manicures and pedicures, I'm always tip top. When they say I'm not high, all these lies need to stop. Cause I'm icy, wifey. Haters wanna fight me. Never been the one get RP up on a whitey. Keep my hands clean, got some hitters moving shicey. Ask me if I'm rolling with some Gucci, but I might be. It's very unlikely. My wrist ain't looking icy. Charging by the minute, cause my time is very pricey. Yeah, I be where the bosses be. Judging for my vibe, you can feel it in my energy. Stacking paper steadily so I can live in luxury. Looking in the mirror, I think I feel what I'm about to be. You be with my enemy, does that make you a friend of me? Girl, so weird, stay clear, I'm living drama free. Never live in company. Keep driving to Calgary. Bret Hart got lucky, bro. He got lucky. Yo, mix him followed you. Hey, that's Alex. Should have been five stars. Bro, listen, it would have been five stars if he didn't hit me with the goddamn uh, sharpshooter. And then freaking... I lose because I thought it was the <sighs> other mission. The home of the famous dungeon. I swear, I can almost hear the wrestlers of the past groaning in pain. <laughs> That's my stomach. For the past two days, I've had nothing but moose jerky, maple puffs, and poutine. Yikes. Look, I just want to say I know I've been a little skeptical, but now that we're here, I can see us doing this. I mean, once Bret Hart hears how far we drove, he's going to have no choice but to welcome us right in for training. So, thanks for pushing me on this. Of course. Well, here we go. <laughs> hey there. I bet you're here for Bret Hart, eh? Uh, hello. Uh, and yes, he's going to train us to be wrestlers. Eh? I'm not sure I'm using that correctly. Is Brett home right now? He is! Hang on a sec. Brett! Two lovely people are here for wrestling training! He'll be right down. I'm sure he's just putting his tights on, gelling up his hair, finding his sunglasses. He's gotta look the part, you know. Of course. So are you oh Brett's housekeeper? Okay, seriously, guys? I'm messing with you. So Brett's not home? No. And he hasn't been for years! The hearts don't live here anymore. But you said... This kind of thing happens like once a month. And I like to have a little fun when I break the news. How is that fun? We just spent three days driving here. And I gave myself severe stomach issues. At this point, we'd settle for one of the more obscure Hart brothers or even a distant cousin. Like I said, none of them are here. You seem like nice kids. Wow, Stupid, that's tough, but that's... nice. Next time, do some research before you decide to drive all the way up here. Jeez. So much for Canadian hospitality. I thought you said you checked all this out online. I did. I mean, I searched for dungeon and wrestling, and then some really weird stuff came up, and I kind of got sidetracked. Point being, don't look at my browser history. But hey, we came all the way here. We should at least get a picture. Eh, can we do another one? I was making a weird face. Probably on account of the stomach pain. Maybe you were right about us trying to become wrestlers. We've already failed at the first thing on our list. And maybe we're not cut out for this. 
Hey, wait, we can't just give up that easily. I have an idea! Okay, so I was wrong about it being Bret Hart's mom. Um, not nothing to do with Bret Hart. Just some beach. Uh, <sighs> who is this jabroni right here? Like, what? If, who is this dude? He looks like he's about to not kill himself, but like looks like he's about to cry or something. So you drove all the way to Calgary thinking you were going to train with Bret Hart? I've done some stupid stuff in my life, but that takes the cake. <laughs> it wasn't our finest moment. <laughs> but since I had a dad who only looked at the rewards section on the credit card bill, we were able to stay in Calgary and learn from a former wrestler who, at least according to him, trained with the Hearts back in the day. I think he just ran next to one on a treadmill once. So that's how you guys hooked up with Riley Flash. Yeah. After striking out at the dungeon, it was kind of our only option. Even though Riley can be a bit much sometimes, he gave us the foundation we needed to get here today. He also gave us ringworm with his dirty mats, but that's a whole other story. Mm. Alright, cool. So that's... Okay, cool. That's the other dude. That's this dude who looks like he's trying to cry, but it's not coming to him. Wait to text can prevent superstars from performing with the moves, but tell your opponents from ah, wait to can prevent superstars from performing with the moves. Much heavier I read that right the first time. Wait to text can prevent superstars from performing with the moves on much heavier opponents. I spelled it wrong. The amount that you superstar can lift is determined by the strength attribute and their own weight. If you attempt a lifting move against an opponent. They don't even tell us how you meet this guy, they just sit in. Oh, so this is how I played uh, Armago Junior. Ah, junior. Ah, I can't talk at all. I, bit, I literally changed your name, and then it still didn't change. Alright, I gotta go back and change your name again because for some reason it's not working. What the? See, I hate throwing people in this game because I never know how to do it. Oh, is he the ref? Yo, can you have him at the ref? Yeah! Mm. Okay, what happens? I just wanna know. What happens, right, if I do this? Oh god! Okay. Oh, Mango Jr. More like Sin Cara Jr. Uh, bitch, no, wait. Man, you got both of them. I want to see what happens. No, I literally can't touch her. Okay, so you can't hit her at all. If you even try to hit her, they just hit you. That's good to know. Oh, let me restart the match. Because I, I was literally just beating up, trying to beat up the other person. The entire time. Mm. I'm 
let me hit her. Don't you dare tag in now, my girl. Fuck you, bitch. Break her damn nut. Bam. So it, it okay. So the thing I want I want to know is if we can have this guy as referee. The Riley Flash dude. Whoa, 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 whoa! That my face just disappeared. Check. I was checking that in and I hit the thing. It looked like it did though. Boom. Is it gonna destroy? Jump, bitch! Jump! Oh my god. Bam! Perform a grapple against Josie Jane while I was standing in the way. There's no one there. Get your feet up on the turnbuckle. Push off and roll backwards. You can pin him like that. Why you gotta make me look like an idiot, dude? It's all right. Yeah, you did good. You did good. Catch your breath. We'll get him next time, all right? You good? <coughs> ah, my God. I wouldn't known to do the thing that she said to do. He looks very sad. He looks like a very sad person. Guys, come here. We need to talk. Yeah. Is it about your disgusting ring mat? Cause I feel like it's making me itch all over. Hey, what was that for? For playing to an imaginary crowd. It cost you the match. Red, great job, keep it up. Remind me why I show up here every day to get tortured? That's not torture if you're paying for it. Now what I didn't tell you was that match was actually a tryout. For what? Is WWE coming to town? Not quite. It was a tryout for the local Winterfest that's coming up. The organizers asked me to put on a wrestling event. That's great. Who are we going to face? I wouldn't mind a rematch against those two. Slow down. After what I just saw, only one of you was ready for their first official match. Sorry, Red. You'll get your chance soon. Uh, Red's the one who's ready, not you, doughhead. What? When it comes to in-ring ability, Red's got you beat by a kilometer. Isn't that less than a mile? Oh, thanks for the conversion, Albert Asswipe. Bottom line, you're too focused on the entertainment oh, side of things. Well, maybe you weren't focused enough on the entertainment side of things. Didn't you only appear in WWE like three times? Uh, four, if you count the time I helped carry Macho Man to the ring on his fancy chair gimmick. 
You mean a sedan? No, it was a chair, not a car. Either way, I was in WWE four more times than you'll ever be. I'll make it there someday. It's on our list. Oh, yeah, and someday I'm gonna poop golden nuggets. No, no offense, Red. Whatever. You'll see. Congrats on getting your first match. You know I'll be there cheering you on. Thanks. I know. Uh, speaking of cheering her on, since you like running your mouth so much, you can accompany her to the ring as a manager. That actually might be a better fit for you long term. A manager? That's not what I'm here for. You'll figure this out. I know it. Oh, one more thing. I need to know what to call you so they can advertise the event. That's easy. I'm sticking with Red. Kids started calling me that in high school because of my temper, but I'm gonna turn it into something positive. Okay. And what about you? Sticking with Denver? Mm, I don't know. Sounds too regional. And Omli. I know. How about uh, Albert Asswipe? Nah. Carl Botch, on account of all the moves you botch? <laughs> I like that one. How about I pay tribute to my wonderful trainer and call myself Riley Flash Jr.? Oh, that ain't happening. Do you have any other nicknames? Trey! No, no, don't listen to her. I kind of like that. And you can spell it T-R-E, so it's kind of like three in Spanish, as in getting a three count to win a match. Which probably won't happen very often for you, but you get it, right? Yeah, I get Why it. Why is he a dick to Great. me? And Trey it is. What Thanks a I lot. Do? No problem, Trey. And hey, I just realized we can cross something off our list. Come up with awesome wrestling names. I don't know about the awesome part. Alright, we got El Mongo Jr. and we got Josie Jane. Yay. Yay. Alright, we're gonna do one more thing and then I'll end it.